My name is Bob Yoop, and I work in the Software Support Engineering Group. Well, I was 19 years old and uh, working at a gas station full time on a midnight shift and working at a grocery store part time during the day. I was married and had a baby and needed a real job. And a friend of mine, his dad was a tool maker at a local shop here in Indianapolis. And he told me that they're always hiring. I had no idea what a machine shop was. I took no trade school classes or anything like that. Um, I hired in and pretty much learned absolutely everything in a matter of about four years, working with a tool maker, uh, sawing parts, learning how to read blueprints, and learning how to run a variety of machine tools. Well, I was working at uh, my first shop and I had a day off and I went for a drive in the country and uh, I passed by a building that had the Herco name on it. And I thought to myself, now I've seen ads in the paper for machinists, so I thought I'd just stop in and see what the Herco was all about. The plant foreman showed me around and wanted to hire me on the spot because they were desperate for machinists. And that's pretty much how I found Herco. Uh, I've actually worked at Herco, hired in several different times. Um, <clears throat> always worked in the machine shop for about the first, on and off for the first 12 to 15 years. Um, I moved up into applications and uh, pretty much was in charge of that department for a while. And business was up and down and I uh, decided to leave and a few years later, the uh, president of the company contacted me because I was actually working for a shop that was owned by Jerry Rock, the founder of Herco. And uh, when their business got slow, the current president contacted me and asked me if I'd want to come and test their software. Currently, I test software um, whether it be new products, uh, existing products. I've worked on the mills and the lathes. A lot of times customers call in and they have issues with either software or the machine tool. And I oftentimes have to go to their shop and try to figure out, is it the machine or is it the software or is it the application? Uh, surprisingly enough, it's pretty equal between the three. Um, my experience has allowed me to help customers figure out better ways to cut their parts. And my experience has also helped me uh, show the software engineers exactly what the machine should do. And uh, we kind of work together and make it all come out good in the end. My name is Charlie McCaw. I work in the Herco tech support department. Growing up, uh, I always knew that my great grandpa, my great uncle, and my dad were all in the machinist industry. And on Saturdays and Fridays, I'd go to work with my dad, stick my rag in my back pocket, put on my safety glasses just like him. And it was something I always knew I wanted to do ever since I was a little kid was be in the machine tool industry. My junior and senior year of high school, I went to a Penna Career Center in Northwest Ohio Vocational School, where I learned manual machining on mills and lathes. Through that, I was involved in SkillsUSA competitions for machining, got second in the state of Ohio, and that also got me scholarships to come to a school here in Indianapolis. The program didn't work out the way I wanted it to, but it also introduced me to Herco, and I've been here since 2014. Being I didn't like the program at the school I was attending here in Indianapolis, I wrote a letter to the president of Herco not really realizing how big of a company it was, um, hoping he could do something about my program. 
Um, he called me a week later and said, I can't do anything about your program, but I can give you an internship here. And if we like you, you can stay on full time. And I've been here for about five years now. So I, apparently they like me. <laughs> and then amongst my service duties, I'm also tightly working with engineering a lot. So it allows me to travel around the country and around the world. So you guys have probably seen me in and out in the field and whether it be your area or at shows. Hey, Charlie. Hey, Bob. Thank you for watching our intro video for our Control for Every Generation campaign. In our upcoming videos, we'll show you how the WinMax Control helps you reduce time and make more chips with features such as probing, solid model import, and much more. See you next time.